we have a Nikon L29 for unboxing here. I bought this as a replacement to my Nikon L23 which has been my second camera so far and is a really good camera within a small budget. The only reason I am replacing is because this one can take 720p videos. These L series Nikons run on AA batteries and that was the reason why I chose the L23 as well as this. The camera came with a 4GB card, a case and uh, two rechargeable batteries and a charger. Box should also have two alkaline batteries inside. This is the card that was bundled with the camera, a class 4 Lexus. The case and the 2100mAh rechargeable batteries with the uh, charger. This is not a quick charger and uh, really takes long time to charge 2100mAh batteries. This is the usual stuff uh, you included with all the point and shoot cameras. Inside the box, we have the list of service centers, warranty card, user's manual in English and the manual in other languages can be downloaded, additional support information, then we have the USB cable. I think this is proprietary to Nikon. This is uh, neither mini USB nor micro USB. Two alkaline batteries. The lanyard. And finally the camera. My L23 was red and I liked it. So bought the same color again. It's a 16.1 megapixel camera with 5x optical and 4x digital zoom. It can record 720p HD video. Optical zoom does not work in uh, video mode. The display is a 2.7 inch TFT LCD. Button layout is similar to other Nikon point and shoot cameras. One difference from my L23 is the direct video record button. Power, zoom and shutter keys. USB cable goes here. Tripod mount. And the speaker vent. Provision for lanyard. Place for memory card and battery. No AV cable is included and uh, we cannot connect the camera to TV directly. These are the box contents. The whole package including the free stuff. Let me open the case. The case is of very poor quality, no proper shape and even the Nikon lettering is not straight. Nowhere near what we can expect from a company like Nikon. Similar case was included with the L23 also but that was far better and, uh, and was a perfect fit. Here the case is too loose and the camera is moving around in the case. Let me turn on the camera. language, time and date, date format,
I'll switch it on and off from different sides. It is unable to focus. Yep. That's all in this video. I'll upload a full review of the camera soon. Do subscribe to my channel for more videos. Hit the like button. Thanks for watching and have a good day.